the thing that we need to understand is that change happens much faster today than any other time in history. What used to take a long time, like the transition to electricity and moving and how cities adapted, today, let's look at something like Airbnb didn't even exist a decade ago. Or the iPhone, just really only has been around since 2007. Technology is moving much faster than any other time. So the question is, are we ready to adapt to this fast moving change? That's the big question we all have to be ready for. And companies like Sonar, for example, can be very well positioned if they're watching all the trends and working with government, working with the private sector to actually deliver those changes. It's a matter of staying ahead of where everybody else is. We have a new generation out there, Gen Z, the millennials. There's more of them than the rest of civilization on the planet today. And we have to realize that they think different, they operate different. They're not interested in owning as much as they're interested in renting. They're interested in ecology. They're interested in the environment. We need to understand what drives them. What are their needs? Because if we don't follow what this new generation wants, we'll never be able to stay ahead. People that are older that don't understand this need to start realizing this new generation is driving where we're headed to the future. Mobility is changing faster than we can realize. Companies like Uber, Lyft, and other car sharing services, they didn't exist, you know, but a decade ago. And they're changing everything. Look at scooters, look at e-bikes. You know, getting that first mile, last mile, maybe five mile, last five miles, all of this is changing. Mobility as a service is really where we're moving to. Somebody has a smartphone in their hand, they wanna be able to walk out of their front door, either an autonomous car comes and picks them up and takes them to the local train station or to a place where other autonomous vehicles come together to move them to their destination. And it's all about having a wireless infrastructure that can communicate with the grid to be able to be able to keep us moving forward. Big data, open data is huge. You know, if we don't have the ability to share data, to know where people are moving, to know where vehicles are, we're never gonna be able to achieve this. So we really have to push the idea of open data, transparent data. You know, we can protect individual companies uh, and what their data shares, but we need to put it onto dashboards and we need to put it into places where we understand the movement of people. So that way local government, state governments, national governments can respond to what their citizens are doing. Well, I think this forum is fantastic. I think you're bringing together some of your smartest people to really capture what the future is all about. If we don't innovate, we die. We need to stay ahead. Let's look at the society we live in today. It's an innovation society and we need to keep up with it. So I commend Senator for putting this program on. I think it's a great way to be able to share such important information so we can plan for the future right now, not let the future plan for us.